Barry in Leicester. Hello. Hello, yes. Yes, very good question. Um, I don't have a television licence because I don't need one. I don't have a TV or anything that I watch. But every two years, the TV licensing people... Uh, sort of, sort of write to me and say, uh, "Can you tell us if you've got a, a, a license? If you, need, if you need a TV license?" And and sometimes the letters get quite sort of over time, quite threatening if I don't respond very quickly. And I was just wondering, is there any legal obligation on me to just simply tell them that I don't need a TV license when I don't need one? No, there isn't, Barry. But if you don't reply to them, then they're going to get suspicious and they're going to send people around and possibly demand entry into your house to see what's going on Uh, because they do have rights of entry in certain circumstances. So just fill in the form and send it back, Barry. It's only every two years. How how, how old are you, Barry? Uh, In my 50s. Okay, so, I mean, is it that big a deal? Um, Not huge, but it's it's more a point of principle, really, because because if I was... You know, absent from the property for a while, for example, the letters get more and more, in some ways, threatening. And one year, they actually sent a letter which contradicted itself. It actually said, you need a TV licence. And then later in the letter, it said, if you need a TV licence, this is how you can get one. Yeah. And I think the tone of the letter and that, I sort of object to, to be honest, because, you know, I feel like they shouldn't be bothering me. It's none of their business in a way. Well, I'll tell you what to do, Barry, if it's the principle. Don't reply to any of their correspondence. Don't let them in your flat or house when they come round. Go to the magistrate's court when they haul you in front of the magistrates for non-payment of fines. Defend yourself. Hope the magistrates believe you and be laughing when you're, wrong end of a, when you're on the wrong end of a £2,000 legal bill, even if you're successful at persuading the magistrates. That's your point of principle for you, Barry. Sound a good idea? Or is it easier... Uh- just to fill uh, in the form. Sorry, I don't quite understand. You're saying they can still take you to court? Of course they can. If, if you're non-cooperative, if you don't let them in the house, they'll take you to court. Right. So um, it, it's easy just to fill in the form.